Hello, and welcome back to Season 6, Episode 5 of Pit Tonight. I'm your host, Victoria Chua, and I'm very excited about our slate of guests tonight. So they are on the executive board of one of Pitt's most philanthropic and active organizations, Pitt Dance Marathon. So today we have Neam Dawson, the president, Rachel Strayer, the operations director, and Emma Wooten, the recruitment director. So thank you all so much for being here. Thank you for having us. Oh, yeah. Neov, uh, for those who don't know, could you tell us what Pit Dance Marathon is? Yeah, so Pit Dance Marathon, also known as PDM, is one of the largest student-run philanthropies on campus. Um, we raise funds and awareness for the Children's Hospital of Pittsburgh that's right in Lawrenceville. And we raise these through different activities and fundraisers throughout the year. And we're basically built on the belief that every child deserves a safe, happy, and healthy childhood. Awesome. Uh, well, what inspires you guys? Why do you guys do it? Yeah, so PDM has this thing we like to call our whys, basically why we keep coming back every day, why we sit in long meetings and plan this 12 hour dance marathon. Um, and your why can come basically from either developing it in the organization or having it beforehand. So a lot of people come in with a dance marathon experience. And my why actually came from in the organization. I started in PDM as a freshman um, in 2018. And I, that year got to walk in our fashion show, which is this big event right before our dance marathon at the end of the year where the kids get to come in and walk down the aisle in their like cute dresses and suits and shirts and whatever they wanna wear and just get people to cheer for them. And that year I get to walk with a little girl named Heidi. And Heidi didn't have um, cancer or um, anything why she needed to be in the children's hospital, but actually her younger sister did. Um, and Nora had been in the hospital for a couple of years now. And when I was walking with Heidi, she kind of told me her story. Um, and I have a younger sister and I would never want her to have to worry. I would never want to have to worry about her the way Heidi was worrying about her sister. And it took up so much of her time that every time I go into a PDM event, I have um, Heidi in the back of my mind saying, if she had to worry about that so much, I wanna maybe relieve some of that worry and have a little bit more fun and try to um, bring joy to these kids. Um, so that's my why and everyone's is so different. So I'm gonna let Rachel see, say her why now too. Yeah, so my why is definitely a little bit different. I was not a member of PDM my freshman year. I worked on Tuesday nights, so I was unable to attend the info session. Um, but my roommate was. So I kind of got the room to myself on Tuesday nights. So that's kind of how I came to know PDM. Um, but then I was invited to come to their event that year. And I met Leo and Jimmy, who are two of our miracle kids. And I ran around with them all day. Um, they were painting faces, they were making tutus, they were just laughing and having such a good time. And it was so inspiring to me to see that these little boys who have been through so much in their short lives have so much fun and just be so out there and just willing to make other people smile. Um, so I just realized that this is where I wanted to be. This is an event that I really wanted to make a mark on. Um, so I got involved. So yeah, so mine is definitely different. So I would love to hear Emma's. Yeah, so mine is actually uh, similar to Neob. So I started freshman year as well. I signed up just because my roommate at the time uh, had done this in high school or something of the sorts in high school. So um, she was like, hey, we should do this. And I said, okay. Little did I know that, you know, four years later, it occupies 85% of my life. Um, but yeah, so I met the kids the same time Neob did um, at the fashion show freshman year. I got to walk with a little girl named Lily. She stole my heart right away. Um, the theme that year for the fashion show was what the kids wanted to be when they grew up and she wanted to be a teacher. So she dressed like a teacher. She had a little jean jacket on, a little dress. And um, she looked at me in my face and told me she couldn't wait to be a teacher. And if I can give her that opportunity to be a teacher in her future and give these kids a brighter future, that's honestly why I do it. I wanna give these kids a chance to have a future and, you know, live out their dreams like they want to so badly, so. Oh, I mean, you, your stories are going to make me cry. <laughs> Those are so lovely and such wonderful reasons. 
Um, and you guys clearly care so much about this. And I bet there are many, many others that would want to get involved and have their own why. So Emma, could you tell us how someone could get more involved with the organization? Yeah, so in the beginning of each semester, especially this year, we've been recruiting people all year. Um, so that's like through the activities fair. And we have so many different panels that you guys can choose from if you were to get involved. So there's membership panel, programming panel, finance panel, media, outreach, for recruitment, operations, and the marketing relations panel. Um, so there's so many things that you guys can get involved with, which is awesome. And it gives you guys real world experience to working with a nonprofit, which is what I have valued the most. And I have come to realize that that's something that I want to do in my life. So that's awesome. Um, and on top of that, uh, just registering for PDM. If you're on staff or not, you can register and commit to raise money for the Children's Hospital um, by going to pdm.pit.edu or texting PDM2021 to 51555. Um, and there's no like real requirement. You just are committed to raising money uh, for the children. So yeah. Awesome. Well, is there something someone can do to support PDM even if they're not part of the organization? Yeah, so uh, you can live stream it on March 20th, 2021. It's gonna be from 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. Um, and you can find us on Instagram uh, at pit underscore PDM. And our Facebook page is Pit Dance Marathon. So uh, you can support us in any way that way. You can donate to us at pdm.pit.edu. And you can get involved through other student organizations that you're in um, by creating a team if you would like to. Oh, there's a lot of ways to get involved with this super, super amazing student organization. So I know that you said March 20th is the day of the event. Uh, Rachel, can you tell us what's in store for that day? Yeah, absolutely. So this is going to be a can't miss event. It's a culmination of our year long fundraising efforts. This year is definitely gonna look a little bit different due to COVID. So our hybrid style event is going to couple a 12 hour broadcast where we've actually partnered with the university's um, Department of Broadcasting, and they've been such a big help in getting everything together. And we're also going to have some in-person COVID safe stations um, that people can visit throughout the day. So the things that you can do there are going to include making cards for the kids at the hospital, as well as making bracelets, playing lawn games, um, kind of things that we would have at our in-person event in any other year, but safely. Um, so it's very exciting. And it's from 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. on March 20th, 2021. Awesome. So a lot of planning must have gone into just that one day. Uh, but is there anything leading up to that day? Yes, absolutely. In PDM, we always have things going on. Um, so the first week of March, the, um, the Thursday, we're actually having a push day. So we're pushing to raise as much money as we possibly can on that day. So if you're feeling so inclined to donate, save it for that day. Um, and we also have a talent show on March 11th at 7 p.m. So our Miracle Kids have submitted videos of themselves performing, singing, dancing, just being amazing little kiddos. Um, so make sure that you get your tickets for that. They're on our website. Um, you can find them there. And just any way that you can support, PDM is all about it. Well, based on our talk, I think that many, many Pitt students uh, have just been motivated to join this amazing organization. Um, so thank you all so, so much for being here today. And I hope that your event is a massive success. Um, again, March 20th, everyone be there. <laughs> thank you guys.